Yeah, know what fills you up and know what trigger foods to keep out of the way. Like for me, it's... An accessory, like an arm movement like that, that's okay to get, get the other one to help a little bit, okay? Good. Shorten. Ooh, watch out. Welcome back guys to the seven day rapid fat loss series. Hope you guys have been enjoying this series. And uh, this is part three of Dick Seven. Uh, I had to break it up into three parts because otherwise it would have been one long ass video. But there's a lot of good information in these videos. That's why I decided to split it up into three uh, instead of just cutting it all short. A lot of good uh, information, especially if you are trying to grow those arms. So I'm gonna let you sit back and enjoy the rest of the video. Uh, but before you do, write down in the comments uh, what your favorite go-to diet food is. Enjoy the rest of the video. We are going to superset uh, cable kickbacks with some barbell curls. So with this, it's tricky, okay? Cause you don't wanna pinch your fingers right there. All right, so show me how you normally would grip. Okay, so you can do that, but our gym, if you look really closely, you can really pinch your fingers right here. So, what I want you to do, and most gyms are like that to be honest with you. What I want you to do is put this underneath that little ball, all right, and then tuck your hand underneath. There you go, you got a little safety cushion now. Ah, all right, that one's free. Let's go. Lightweight. Okay for my wrist to be slightly outside because I'm supinating. Right. It's a big word right there. <laughs> seven after that workout you know all we did is just hit arms uh, just an extra accessory day we did the bike uh, for about 30 35 minutes and uh, yeah I'm gonna go home I went to Ralph's I don't have any chicken prepped so I bought some prepackaged chicken which I'll show you can throw that in a gigantic salad um, I actually was thinking about going a little bit different, getting a little, um, you know, spicy with it, <laughs> with the ingredients, and just making, uh, eating the chicken, having some veggies, and throwing some barbecue sauce on there. 
and although it sounds delicious, which I'll probably throw some barbecue sauce on my salad, it's not gonna it's not gonna keep me full. And I know if I eat that, I'm gonna continue eating and I'm gonna overeat. So that being said, guys, um, another major key that you guys could learn along the way is eat foods that are gonna be filling, like eat stuff that's gonna keep you full for a long time and uh, that way it's gonna help you um, you know I'm a big eater like it, it's gonna help you to not get hungry not that you won't be tempted because temptations are, are always gonna be there so you're you're gonna be tempted no matter what that's where you gotta just know why you started you know like that saying goes and uh, and do not give in to temptation uh, or overindulgence I should say but yeah know what fills you up and know what trigger foods to keep out of the way like for me it's cookies I used to be able to to kind of like you know uh, you know gauge it out and have three cookies at a time six six cookies at a time and still hit my macros for the day but currently I know I can't do that so I'm not getting cookies anywhere near me. Um, yeah, gonna eat that, show you what I eat, show you what I finish with. A little over, that's fine. That'll do pig. That'll do. All right, guys. So I am beat. Oh, there's a big glare off my glasses. I'm beat. Um, as you saw, I added the extra chicken. What I'm gonna finish the night out with is another protein bar. So two of those protein bars, one, Len one Lenny and Larry's cookie, uh, and then two salads. That's it, seven days. Uh, I think only one of the days I was at 1,700 calories. Everything else I've been 1,600 or less. I haven't decided if I'm gonna continue this for another seven days or not, but I will tell you this, <laughs> more, <laughs> I can't guarantee it, but I'm probably gonna have that burger and that, um, what is it, burger chili dog and the potato salad tomorrow and since I know you guys don't believe me I'm gonna show you where it's at still here guys still here because I know you guys don't believe me unfortunately everything is still intact it looks like one of those plastic dinners <laughs> all right so that's it, seven days. See how I feel, hopefully, um, hopefully with the weight, or hopefully with the excess fiber, you know the weight has been flushed out, so I can use the restroom in the morning and get a more accurate reading of my weight. Um, but if not, no big deal, I can tell my body has transformed and changed uh, significantly. Uh, I believe my waist has gone down at least an inch in, this, in one week. Not bad, um, or inch or inch and a half, whatever. Uh, but anyways, we'll see where I go. Might continue for seven more days, might not. Either way, hope you guys have enjoyed this little series or continuation of a series and have picked up a few things along the way. Please do not do not forget to like this video. If you guys are new to YouTube, it's that thumbs up button. Like the video, helps the channel grow. Comment anything that you liked, anything that you didn't like, what you thought was sustainable, how nasty you thought my salad was, whatever. Comment down below, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next video.